Okay, so if you've been following my channel for some time, you might have noticed the controversy over one particular element on Steel Curtain, and that's the banana roll, or is it? When we jump over to RCDB, we will see that the banana roll element is actually labeled as a Cobra roll. Well, it was until here recently. When I was doing my research for this video, I jumped over to RCDB, and lo and behold, it is no longer listed as a Cobra roll, but a banana roll. Even more shocking, RCDB has Steel Curtain listed with 8 inversions instead of 9. I'm sure this is going to ruffle some feathers over at Palace Entertainment and Kennywood. To start things off, let's check out the definitions of a banana roll and cobra roll. First, a banana roll is considered to be one inversion. This element looks like a hybrid between a cutback and a cobra roll. It's basically like if you were to take a cutback inversion and bend it forward so the side view would actually look like the shape of a banana. Since the ride never completely levels out mid-element, we consider this a single inversion. Takabisha, which is in Japan, features the first ever banana roll and is considered one inversion. A cobra roll, which is similar to a banana roll, is two inversions. This inversion is basically two half loops and two half corkscrews combined together to form a turnaround boomerang element. Some actually refer to this element as a boomerang, but they're both the same thing. A banana roll and cobra roll look very similar, with the primary difference being the amount of inversions they complete. So, I guess the big question in today's video is, does Steel Curtain complete 9 inversions? If that's the case, it can't be labeled a banana roll. But if it has 8 inversions, which contradicts all statements and records the park is claiming, it must be something similar to a cobra roll. In my opinion, when we take a look at the banana roll on Takabisha and the one allegedly on Steel Curtain, we will see that they have some similarities, but in fact are different. The shape and the way that the inversion, or in my opinion, inversions completed on Steel Curtain is more like a cobra roll instead of a banana roll. After completing the first inversion of the banana roll on Steel Curtain, riders are then rotated to a 90 degree angle before then rotating back into the second inversion. The banana roll on Takabisha doesn't rotate completely back to a 90 degree angle, keeping you slightly inverted. The real question here is why did SNS decide to call this a banana roll when they claim it's two inversions and yet the original designer of the banana roll, Gerstlauer, created Takabisha and labeled their banana roll as one inversion. In previous videos, I called the banana roll on Steel Curtain a banana inversion because I thought that's actually what the park originally was calling it during their announcement, but I went back and watched that video and they do indeed call it a banana roll. So what does this all add up to? Was this a flawed marketing tactic that mislabeled Steel Curtain from the beginning? Does SNS not consider the banana roll on Takabisha to be legit? Because they themselves clearly say that Steel Curtain will feature the first ever banana roll, which isn't true. Does Steel Curtain have nine inversions or eight? Is it a cobra roll, banana roll, or something else entirely? One final point I want to make. If we look at Max Force, the other new roller coaster by SNS, the first set of inversions looks extremely similar to the banana roll on Steel Curtain. I see that RCDB doesn't even label this element, but does claim Max Force has five inversions, so this first element must be two inversions. If I were to label it, I would say that Max Force features a Cobra roll just like Steel Curtain. In conclusion, according to my opinion, Steel Curtain does not feature a banana roll because a banana roll is one inversion and the element that we see on Steel Curtain is two. We can't just apply the same name to different elements, that would be confusing. For now, unless the manufacturer decides to rename the banana roll on Steel Curtain, I will call that element a Cobra roll and will also say that Steel Curtain has nine inversions. Well, I don't think I could have made another video with me saying banana roll or cobra roll more than what I just did in this video. Let me know what you think of this whole controversy in the comments below. Does Steel Curtain have a banana roll or cobra roll? Does it have eight or nine inversions? Let me know. As always, please subscribe so you don't miss out on more great content coming your way by X Scream Thrills.